everyone, and welcome back to Kaiser and the Voices. I'm Kaiser Akron, the host with the voices, and welcome back to Kaiser Plays Super Mario 64. Last episode, we finished up our business here in the clock, and we started going through the rainbow ride, and... <laughs> we don't talk about the red coins. And in this episode, we are going to finish off our mission in the rainbow ride, but first, I have a star that I missed. This one. How in the bloody hell did I miss this? Seriously, it was right freaking there, and it eluded me. So we're up to 101, which means 19 more to go. And if my calculations are correct, and I'm hoping that they are, we've got two more to do here, and the next one is one that I have been dreading since the beginning. So after we get the two that are here... We then have to go back and get all of the 100 coin missions, and the very last star that we will receive on this particular Let's Play will be the final red coin mission, yes, it's going to be a red coin mission, in Bowser's final stage. That'll be the last one we get, and then we fight Bowser, and then this series is kaput. Now, for this particular mission, you see those triangles? You see them? That's where we're going. Gotta go deal with some triangles. Why? Because this game hates me. Okay, less pessimistic thing aside, that's the challenge. See, you have to basically beat the clock with these triangles. That's the goal. You have to get across the triangles as fast as you can, because that timer is... If I'm being honest? <laughs> what the hell just happened there, Mario? Uh, if I'm being honest, that is the trickiest thing to do in this game is to beat the triangle puzzle. Now, obviously, the 100 coin mission, that's its own separate entity, and I will deal with that soon enough. I mean, we're down to the last two in this level, so, I mean, not much else there is. But, regardless of the fact, this particular mission has given me trouble no matter the age group. Even now, as a 27 going on 28 year old, which, holy crap, I am old. Uh, even now, in my adulthood, it is still one of the hardest things to do. You know, I, I hate it. I absolutely hate it. Because you need such precision to beat it. And it's just a pain. <sighs> Not aided by the fact you have trials getting you there in the first place. So yeah, essentially you have to go through all this hubbub. You gotta do it quick, because this thing is strict. And if you don't, you slip and... What the hell did I do it on my first try? <laughs> what? Okay. Um. Well, I feel like a liar. <laughs> Holy moly. Okay. So, that was tricky triangles. Uh, uh, it was a lot harder than I remember it. I, I remember having more trouble with that than I usually do, but there you go. Anyways, uh, let's move on to the last one, Somewhere Over the Rainbow. Hey, Judy Garland, uh, the reference is not lost on me. I mean, it fits, you know, like, it really does. Anyways, let's not get shocked by the Electra Ball and not let the carpet go away. We are going on this magic carpet ride, Aladdin. I don't care what you have to say about it. Okay, so let's just ride this. Now, this one just involves riding the path again, and instead of going to the top of the ship, we are... Goodbye, Lakitu! <laughs> we are going to instead find the cannon, and we are going to blast ourselves out of it. And yes, that ship does have a cannon, so don't fret about that. Now, did I unlock said cannon? But isn't the pink bob -omb on the ship anyway? Like, I think that's where the bob -omb is. If not, I've got to hunt some bob -ombs. Well, at least a pink bob -omb. So, yeah. <sighs> Let's just ride the waves, ride the rainbow waves, man. Ride that pride wave. I mean, by pride, but still. <laughs> Actually, all pride, because, yes. Anyways, we gotta ride that one on the left. Yep. I will say that's one thing about this level that's kind of tedious, is waiting for the rainbow carpets and avoiding all the fire that comes with it. Because seriously, fire is prevalent everywhere in this level. While fitting, given you're going to go fight Bowser after this, technically, you know, it does feel a little bit heavy-handed. At least in my opinion, it does. But, I mean, 
you can look at it this way. You got fire jets in most of the level, and then you got that blue fire jet, like, right freaking there. Like, you think that's enough? You think that's enough flames? Especially because those are blue. What's the difference? It's going to burn your butt and give you three to four ticks of damage if you ain't careful. So what's the difference? Just just, just make it red. Just make it red. Or, or you know what? Make it all blue. Because I like blue. Blue's my favorite color. Well, I mean, teal's my favorite color, but still. Just, yeah. All right. Whoa, focus, boy. Don't get distracted by... Land on the thing. <laughs> that was close. See, this is what happens when you get distracted and you ramble. You, you, you make, you're, you're prone to mistakes. And mistakes are fine sometimes. You know, you grow and you learn from your mistakes. But in this case, the mistakes leave you with four ticks of damage and you, you have half your health. And now I've got, like, a pie wedge missing, which my OCD drives me crazy about that sort of thing. It's just like, I see it there. And I know there's a dark blue wedge in my light blue pie and I don't like it! I'm a little weird today, I've noticed. <laughs> My apologies, I just woke up. <sighs> okay, let's focus. Let's focus here. Back on the carpet. Back on this carpet ride. You're going to get this star, and then we're going to start the tedium of 100 coins. Finally. And no, that, that I've honestly saved that for last, because that is going to be just uh, so much fun. It's also a good time to, like, go back to each of the levels and just enjoy them for what they are. It's like a nice little, like, rounding up of all the levels before the end game, you know? And technically speaking, this will be the last level we visit before the end anyway, so there is that to contend with. So, yeah, this is not the last we will see of the Majestic Rainbow. I guarantee that. And speaking of, this technically isn't going to be our last flight in the skies, because we've still got that one area on the side of the right, or the left, blah, 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 that one little area on the side of the area where the clock is. Yeah, it does have a star. So, uh, we gotta deal with that. And that one's fun. It can be a lot of fun if you know what you're doing. Backflip here. Okay, jump. Jump on that. Alright, I should have the thick... Oh, for the love of... And I fall right off. You know, <laughs> it's not my day today. Mario, my man, how do you how do you screw that up? Like, how do you mess that up that spectacularly? I have to ask you. Anyways. Ride the carpet again. <laughs> oh, I'm not having it today. I am not having it today. Let's just focus. Let's focus on getting through. I'm honestly also kind of memorizing coin locations because that's going to be the next big thing is getting all the coins later on for the 100 coins. So I got to make sure I've got... Oh, hey, Mario, don't slip off the edge with your butter shoes, okay? Can you not? We need you to stay focused here, man. Focus on the task at hand, laddie. All right, careful. Hello, spiny. Yeah, it's weird that the Lakitus throw the spinies. I mean, well, it's not. They've been throwing them since the original, but... I don't know, the spines just look kind of neat in this game. They're tiny and easy to avoid. I say that, and then later on I'm going to get, like, pummeled by them. You watch. So, yeah. I will say I love the music in this level, though. Like, that is one thing that, no matter how old I get, I just love. Like, I especially love that halfway into it, you just get, like, a little whistle solo. Like, that's just cute. That is honestly just the cutest freaking thing. Anyways, that aside, let's keep going. Let's keep riding the friggin' rainbows. Hello, Lakitu. Leave me alone. And he tries to throw a spiny on the carpet, and it fails. It's just like, boy, Bye. That's it. <laughs> That's all she wrote, folks. All right, now let's just keep going. Ride the freaking rainbow. Going around in circles. Kind of like my existence right now. I mean, well, what? <laughs> Jokes aside... I literally, I'm going in rainbow circles, you know? That's just the long and short of it. It's not a de deprecation joke. It's literally the it's literally the life right now. I am Mario on a carpet going around rainbow circles. What else do you want me to say? Okay. There's the ship with its weird wing oars that honestly just look like paper cutouts. I mean, honestly, they do. Like, look at them. Those look like paper freaking cutouts to me. Am I the only one? I feel like the only one. Please don't tell me I'm the only one. Oh, God. All right, jump. Okay, you're on the thing. 
Now, Mario, let's do this right this time. Thank you. All right, we go all the way over here. Yes, the cannon is open. All right, so we just need... Look, E2. Don't you freaking dare, buddy boy. Into the cannon. And we just need one perfectly good shot. Just gotta land on the pole. Land on the pole, Mario. Just land it. Oh. Don't get caught by the bomb bomb now. Just hit the box. Hit the box. Hit the box. Get the star. Get the star. Get the star. Get the star. Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. Thank you. Thank you, Mario. Yes. Okay. Got the star. We are technically done with this place for now. Now, let's go to the other side. So let's go in here. And as you notice, there's a big bright light in this area, so it must be special. Down we go. Whoop. So yeah, we're in the clouds, quite literally, for another red coin mission. And thankfully, this one is not as mind melty as the last one, which I do not know why. I had such issues with that red coin mission. I I'm going to be honest. I do not know why. Okay, so this one involves the wing cap, obviously. So what you gotta do is fly through the area. Uh, there's a cannon there, so you gotta find the pink bomb that, that corresponds to. And what you gotta do is just fly from cloud to cloud, collect the coins. What I like to do during all this is I like to collect the wing caps on every cloud just to make sure the meter stays high. And that way I have a better chance of, you know, collecting all the coins. Because, yeah, eight red coins and all that. Hello, get the cannon ready, please. Thank you. That opens that one, and also opens the one up on the top, so that way you have an easy vantage point for shooting and for flying. All right, is there any up here on this straw? I know there is one down below, but just to be sure, you never know. All right, into the cannon. Let's prepare to blast ourselves like a circus performer. Okay, so there's a five more coins, and there's going to be some hidden on top of the clouds. There's going to be some in clouds, because that's a thing in this level. So you just got to make your way. Mario, I have a question for you. How do you manage to pull off ridiculousness like that? Like How, how do you manage the impossible feat of doing the dumbest friggin' things? Seriously, how do you manage it, man? How? How do you freaking do it? You make no sense to me. Seriously, you're an adorable man. But personally, I prefer your brother Luigi. Yes, I am Team Luigi, just so you know. Like, I love Mario. Mario has a legacy. And he uh, he will always have my respect. But I cannot deny the fact that I prefer the green bean over the red portly plumber. Because Luigi's just sweet. He's a genuine sweetheart. You know, the guy's got a heart of gold. He's shy as hell. You know, he's just bean. Like, I don't know, just to me, Luigi has always been the better brother, at least in my eyes. I know there's a few people who will say Mario's the best, and I'm sure there's plenty of people who will say Luigi's the best, and for those of us in the Luigi camp, today is our day, because Luigi is best. Hashtag Luigi best boy. All right, let's, let's get these coins proper this time. Let's do this. Because, as you've noticed, this level, did the, did the cap actually just fall off the cloud? I honestly wouldn't be surprised if that's what happened, because this level can be a bit of a pain in the butt. Alright, there's no coin here, but I just wanted to get that extra life. Now, you can't technically die in this level, though. That's the one positive. You will not lose a life here, because what happens is, well, you saw earlier, you just fall through the freaking clouds and down into the moat. Well, not even the moat, more like the castle's lake, which this castle has a freaking lake when you really think about it. Alright into the cannon all right so let's go fly a cloud now, quite literally we're gonna fly on fucking clouds that that's that that's the goal okay we're on the top now we need to get up there to where those straws are they honestly do look like freaking straws all right is there a coin over on this thing no but there's a bunch of small yellow coins and a solid cloud to walk on, so not the worst thing in the world, I think. As I let the thing fall. You know, I gotta stop letting these things get out of my hand. Okay, let's fly up a little bit just so we can get this one particular coin that is in what honestly looks like a storm cloud. Ugh. 
Some of these are a little hard to get, as you can see. So yeah, make sure... <laughs> I forgot that you could get stuck in the clouds. Quite literally in this instance. Alright, did I get the thing in question? Alright, let's get up there. Come on, get to the platform. Get to the platform and actually land on it, please. Mario, Mario. Okay. I thought he was going to do that thing where he hits it and then just falls flat on his face. Okay. Let's get the wing cap. Get it? Thank you. Focus now. You have to focus and get the coins. Get the coins. Okay. <laughs> if you're wondering why I'm giggling, I just heard a very tired Paula in the back just imitate Lugagen. <laughs> ah, I love her. She, she's so sweet. Anyways. Let's get to the other platform to shoot ourselves out of the cannon. Let's do this. Come on, get there, get there, get there. Thank you. Plop. I always love to do a ground pound into stuff like that. It's just, it's fun. All right, so where are we shooting? All right, we're going to get that particular coin. I want to get that coin first. Okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, slow it down, Mario. Slow it down. I know you just got shot out of a cannon, but please, let's get the coin here. Uh, you know, when I said get the coin, I meant grab it. Thank you. Let's get back to the main platform so that way we don't screw this up. <sighs> he still manages to take damage, the friggin' schmuck. Alright, in we go. Three more to go. Honestly, this mission just takes a bit on its own. You know, like, just because you gotta focus on getting these coins. It's a real pain in the neck. Or in Mario's case, a pain in the butt. Quite literally, because he keeps <laughs> hurting himself. How'd you manage that, you goober? Okay, well, let's shoot ourselves up to the straws. So you get... Alright, ooh, good catch there, Mario. Okay, let's lower ourselves just a bit. There we go. Alright, is there anything below us? Yes, there is. Okay, good. So I'm not going to die of ridiculousness. Okay, grab the wing cap. Awesome. Now, there's two more coins, and I do believe they're on top of the cloud that we were just on. So, we're going to have to go back to this cannon, and we're going to have to shoot ourselves out of it. Alright, let's do this. Let's do it. Let's get up there. Can we even get up there? That's my question. Can we? Oh, yeah, we can. No, we're fine. Okay, there's a red coin, which means there's one left. Oh, there it is. Perfect. Alright, now we just got to go collect the star. Which honestly is the most the scary part of this one. Is actually being able to get the star. Okay. Just one, two, three. Okay. Find the star location. Let's just find it. Find whoa, hey, whoa, slow down, Mario. I know you're excited, I know. This one can be a bit of a pain, but let's get to the star and actually end this thing. Thank you! Alright. I think. We are going to cut it here today, ladies and gentlemen, because, well, now begins the 100 coin gauntlet. So we're going to be going back to bob -on Battlefield to begin our trials. There's 15 levels, which means 15 stars that are 100 coin mission based. God help me, this is going to be a long one. So get ready, folks. But until then... Thank you all so very much for watching. If you enjoyed this, please leave a like and a comment in the boxes below, letting me know your favorite moments from this episode. Also be sure to subscribe, hit the notification bell, and make sure all notifications are turned on, so you know when we're going to start getting a lot of freaking coins. Also share this video around, your continued viewership and support is greatly appreciated. And of course, a very special thanks to the Tier 2 and Tier 3 Patreon supporters, those being... Sebastian Canino, Aaron Lena, iShipit88, Jesse Barbo6, Panda475, Nagi Oki, Silverfox MZ, Jay Zolman, Angelique De La Rouge, Mighty Chlorophyte, Honor Higgins, Jesse Alvarez, Horizon Dreamer, Happy Haunts 999, Grimmy Leon, Zodiac Demirs, Ruby the Wolf, Harley Wolf, and Katie Honey Jade. If you'd like to support the Patreon family, as well as get videos 24 hours in advance, along with exclusive Let's Plays, check the link in the description below to our Patreon. And with that said, this is Kaiser! And I will see you all next time. Bye-bye.